What if there was a garage filled with cars chosen by geniuses like Steve Jobs, legendary racers like Paul Newman? Cars that are not just powerful, but also symbols of status and incredible taste. Each model here is like a piece of art growing in value yearly. They represent stability and long-term value for true collectors. Do you guess what this exclusive garage is? It's the one and only Porsche Museum in Stuttgart, where history, innovation and racing legends come to life in every detail, making this collection of cars a true work of art in speed and engineering. I spent a day in this unique place with my family. In this video, I'll reveal the unique secrets behind some Porsche models. You'll find out how many millions of dollars people are willing to pay for these cars. And you'll get my honest review of the museum. But let's go step by step. And first, let me tell you about the gifts we received. As soon as we entered, we were given small souvenirs, a nice touch that sets the friendly atmosphere of this place. The Porsche Museum isn't just an exhibition, it's a journey into the world of engineering, mastery and racing legends. It feels like each room opens a new chapter in the brand's history, where every car looks like a piece of art. And for the kids, especially our 8-year-old, there were interactive zones and simulators where he could feel like a real racer. He loved it. The building itself is as impressive as the cars inside. With its high-tech futuristic design of glass and metal, it feels like you're in a center of innovation. The first room is dedicated to Porsche's earliest models. Here stands the Porsche 356, the very first car from the brand marking the start of Porsche's history. Looking at this car, it's hard not to admire the creators who set a standard for quality, style and reliability that turned Porsche into a symbol of luxury. Honestly, I'm a bit jealous of those who got to drive these classics. These models are probably a dream for many. It's fascinating that the story of Porsche begins with the story of its founder, Ferdinand Porsche. This is a story not only about the brilliance of an engineer, but also about overcoming challenges and following a dream. Born in 1875 in the small town of Maffersdorf in Austria-Hungary, now the Czech Republic, Ferdinand showed an unusual interest in technology from a young age. It's hard to imagine that a simple boy from a small town would one day create a world-famous brand. In this video, I'm not here to give you a history lesson on how Porsche was created, but this brand is definitely one that can't help but inspire and impress. A strong desire to make only the best and the courage to take risks became the foundation of Porsche's success. The brand quickly built a reputation as a maker of premium sports cars. These cars combined both speed and reliability, making them perfect for racing as well as everyday life. Every success Porsche has had began with one big dream and a lot of hard work. His story truly inspires me. And today, decades later, the spirit of Ferdinand Porsche lives on in every car from this brand. Porsche is not just a car, it's a symbol of overcoming challenges and a passion for perfection that continues to inspire people worldwide. How can you not admire this legacy knowing that the journey to success was difficult but filled with strength and determination?
But let's get back to the museum. Moving further, we reach a room filled with iconic cars, each with its own unique story. One of them is the Porsche 917, a legend of the Le Mans race winning on tracks where only a few can handle the speed. Steve McQueen, a well-known actor and racing enthusiast, starred in the film Le Mans while driving a Porsche 917K. After the film, this car became a symbol of speed and skill, and its value skyrocketed. In 2017, the very same Porsche 917K from Le Mans was sold at a Goodin and Company auction for an impressive $14 million, making it one of the most expensive Porsche cars in history. This sale underscores Porsche's impact not only in motorsports, but also in popular culture. Standing next to these cars, you start to feel their energy and understand the spirit behind these legends. Interestingly, Porsche himself and his son personally tested the Porsche 917 on one of the most iconic and challenging roads in the world, Gross Glockner. You can find more about this road in my video, the world's most iconic high alpine road. It's fascinating that these cars inspired not only engineers and racers, but also celebrities like Paul Newman, a legendary actor and racer who loved speed and often drove Porsche race cars. Jerry Seinfeld, a famous comedian and actor, has one of the largest private Porsche collections in the world, including rare models that no one else owns. These people admired Porsche not only for its speed and style, but also for its status, a car that highlighted their uniqueness and success. This shows that Porsche is not just a way to get round. It's an asset that becomes more valuable over time. For kids, this place is an adventure. Our oldest son spent a lot of time in the interactive zones, playing on simulators, and trying his skills as a Porsche racer. The museum is designed so that everyone, not just adults, can enjoy it, allowing you to see the cars and feel like a driver on the track. This isn't just a museum, it's a place where every family member finds something they love. Would you like to try driving a Porsche race car? From classics, we move to modern models, and in front of us is the Porsche Carrera GT, a car that has already become a legend and a status symbol. This car combines advanced technology and style, making it one of the most desirable models among collectors. With this car, Porsche showed that the line between racing and road cars is almost gone. The Carrera GT delivers incredible power and speed that you usually only find on the track, but here it's available for regular roads. It's a true supercar and one of the most comfortable and easy to handle in its class. Nearby is the Porsche 911 GT3, a model that proves perfection has no limits. This car is packed with the latest technologies designed for racing but adapted for everyday driving. Porsche engineers have thought of every detail, improved aerodynamics, a lighter body, and increased engine power make it not just fast, but incredibly stable on the road. The 911 GT3 is a perfect example of how Porsche brings innovative ideas to life 
and why its models are valued not just for prestige, but for technical excellence. These technologies are so inspiring, showing how far Porsche is willing to go to set new standards. Equally impressive are the hybrid Porsche models, which bring together the classic power of the brand with modern eco-friendly solutions. Did you know who made the world's first hybrid car? Few people know that Ferdinand Porsche created the world's first hybrid car as early as the 1900s. The Lone Porsche Mixtec combined an electric motor with a gasoline engine, a revolutionary idea at the time. This was news to me. How about you? This car is a reminder of Porsche's long-standing commitment to innovation and sustainability well before it became popular. The Porsche 918 Spider, for example, is a unique combination of gasoline and electric engines, allowing it to reach amazing speeds with minimal impact on the environment. This is one of the first cars that proved high performance can go hand in hand with environmental responsibility. These models were a breakthrough for Porsche, which managed not only to keep its signature qualities, but also to adapt to the demands of the new age. But what's most amazing is the increase in investment value of every car here. In recent years, the prices of rare Porsche models have skyrocketed. I already told you about the Porsche 917, a racing legend that set a record at the uh, 2017 Goodin and Company auction, where one of its models sold for $14 million. Of course, a car like that is out of my reach for now, but seeing it here, it's already inspiring me to keep moving forward. Another example, Porsche 911 Carrera RS, a top collector's model with auction prices often over $1 million and rare ones reaching $2 million. This model is famous for its unique performance and rarity making it highly sought after among collectors. The Porsche 550 Spider, another historical model, not only for its iconic design, but also for its high price. This car can go for $6 million at auctions. I'll tell you the dark story about that model. The legendary actor James Dean was known for his love of speed and fast cars. In 1955, he bought a Porsche 550 Spider, which he nicknamed Little Bastard. Tragically, Dean died in a fatal crash while driving this car. Since then, the Porsche 550 Spider has gained a mysterious reputation, with rumors of a curse surrounding it. Parts of the car were used in other vehicles, which also encountered strange and dangerous accidents. This dark history has made the 550 Spider even more iconic among collectors. Rare and historically significant Porsche cars have become collectibles that can compete with fine art and luxury real estate. Their value not only holds over time, but steadily increases, making Porsche a reliable asset for long-term investments. How much do you think a unique Porsche could be worth in the future? Moving further, we enter a room with the rarest and most unique Porsche models each one a legend with its own story and exclusivity, attracting collectors worldwide. Among these treasures is the Porsche 911 GT1, created for race car homologation and made in only 20 units. 
This car combines race car technology with street ready features, showing how Porsche turns motorsports into accessible art. It's incredibly to stand next to such a piece of history on wheels. Here you can also find the Porsche 356 America Roadster from 1953, a model created specifically for the American market and made in just 16 units. With its lightweight body, this car stood out for its dynamics even among other sports cars of its time, a true rarity showing Porsche's unique approach to each market and generation. Another ultra-rare model is the Porsche 911 Turbo SE, a lightweight version of the 911 Turbo produced in only 86 units. The reduced weight and increased power made it one of the most desirable cars among collectors, with power and exclusivity combined in every detail. And of course, there are the concept cars created as experimental innovations, many of which set trends in the auto industry. One example is the Porsche 989, a four-door prototype from the late 1980s that was the precursor of the iconic Panamera. This concept shows Porsche's courage to go beyond the usual which has always set it apart from other manufacturers. Looking at these cars, you understand that Porsche is not just a brand, it's a true art and a source of inspiration. Another iconic car, Porsche 959. When the Porsche 959 debuted, it was considered one of the most advanced cars of its time, and many high-profile buyers wanted it. Among them was the Sultan of Brunei, known for his exclusive car collection. He was so captivated by the Porsche 959 that he ordered multiple units simultaneously, reinforcing Porsche's image as a car for the elite and boosting the model's iconic status. Each of these models is not just a car, but a testament to Porsche's drive to reach new heights. Every step here makes you feel that you're standing in front of something great. Machines that combine history, technology and art in one. And as you walk among these masterpieces, it's impossible not to wonder what's next? What will be Porsche's next move to surprise the world? Which model impressed you the most? Before leaving the museum, don't miss the souvenir shop. It's a paradise for Porsche enthusiasts. There's something for everyone, from sleek scale models of iconic cars to stylish clothing, leather accessories and premium keychains. You'll also find books about Porsche's history, exclusive posters, and even limited edition collectibles that make perfect gifts or keepsakes. Thank you so much for watching this video to the end. If you enjoyed it, please show your support with a like and a comment. Also, I recommend checking out my other videos world's most iconic high alpine road or Europe's last tribe hidden 1500m high in the Alps, make sure to subscribe to the channel and see you next time!